Hello and welcome back to Alpha 16 Rimworld. We're just eating up some meals, foggy rain is in, plenty of boomalop meat, and a uh, autumn that feels like it'll bring a true hope for our colonists. Still hasn't learned his lessons, and is just gonna go out and continue hunting. He's like, fuck it. What's, what's the worst that could happen? Huh? That exotic's good trader coming through. We'll, uh, we'll check it out. As soon as Crazy Cat wakes up, his energy is bringing in the stuff. Chickens are outside grazing. That's perfectly fine. Making love. Dropping fertile chicken eggs. Ain't nothing but a gangsta party. Mm-hmm. 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 Battery's doing fine. To the point that I would actually wouldn't mind having uh, another one. Because having four is not bad and I don't mind that at all so we've nothing really going on here I mean we're trying to finish up some research we might actually drop a second research high-tech research bench just to have two researchers uh, mining is still happening for people <clears throat> yeah we're just kind of diddle daddling around Gizmo needs to have his asthma treated I'm pretty sure yeah that's what that was for yeah it's like every about seven days he needs to have a treatment, so that's not that's not that bad. Okay, so he's Gizmo's gonna make some stone chunks, good. Crooked Cook's butchering up some boom wood, crazy cat's mining, Kyle is just hauling some stuff around. Sienna's just cleaning. Sure. Xander again with the idol. We've struck the uranium. Which is pretty impressive in the wall so I guess we'll just kind of leave it there okay so this room still needs to be finished up and I guess everyone's gonna go and have a little bit of a snooze oh really gizmo and hellboy have some kind of an interesting connection uh, hmm well that's interesting Crazy Cat and Hellboy are both women, which is kind of confusing, but you know, this is a very uh, gender neutral kind of colony. He's viewing art. I don't see his needs while he's viewing art, just going through the roof. Oh, yeah, everyone's having a great time. No problems. Great meal, tons of joy, joy wire. Mm -hmm. That's what I like to see, baby. Thank you. Animal starvation. My roosters aren't really eating. Let's go ahead and uh, expand the chicken coop to encompass like this. Good. And then you guys just kind of hang out in this area and eat around here and, you know, sleep in this area. No more chicken stuff. Everything is taken care of. Our crops are fine. Uh, we can actually probably get more crops now maybe something like here let's go ahead and do that sure maybe just like this can be like our medical crop of heel root we need pretty good growers to do that so seven eight seven six damn it hmm Hop plant. Actually, yeah, we're gonna start a brewing. We're gonna start hops. Heal root, whatever. We can always buy more um, medicine. We'll get heal root later. I ain't really tripping about it. We'll cut up some of this more wood. Just so it's not in my base. Just so we have something to do. Good, everyone. Just kind of gardening it up a little bit. That's good. Wonderful. Xander just hanging out. Uh, Xander, you can't garden, can you? Nope. That's fine. Let's go ahead and drop our um, high tech research right here. So we're going to at least have two research places, right? Multiple people equipped to do so. We'll just do like whatever, low priority. So everyone can research whoever wants to research. The ender doesn't really do the researching, so that's fine. Uh, spoilage and freezers, don't need to know about that. Deterioration, medical operations, drug policies. Yes, yes, yes. No one has any addictions or anything. We're all pretty straight edge folks around here. 
No raids or anything. My chickens are fine. Just Xander's a little bit idle. That's fine. Uh, it's kind of dark in here though. Let me just see beauty here. Yeah, it's pretty dirty. That's why. Cleanliness definitely did a uh, change since the last update. And that's just a trader, so we're gonna need to get Crazy Cat. Kyle and Sina just gonna go have some sexy time. Let's go call that bulk, bulk goods trader first. Get some kid, uh, pigs, cats, uh, chocolate, meat, cloth. Mm. Synthroid sells for quite a bit actually. We'll sell all that extra stuff, huh? All the leather. That's fine. Uh, we'll keep our joints. Okay. Steel. You guys got quite a bit of this. Get like 500. Steel. Plus steel. Wood. Yeah, some decent stuff like that. That's fine. We don't need any gold. And yeah, it looks good to me. Thanks. Steel and gold. Alright, good, great. Uh, this over here has connected up with power conduit. Uh, no, it has not. Just so we can have, I don't know, if they come and smash my these fucking things, we still have a cable out here. Good, thank you, crazy cat. Uh, let me see this now. Cargo pods. Let me go here to my security. Security. Something like this. And like so. Let's check out these cargo pods. Camel here. Sure. It's real close by. Fine by me. Just expanding our defenses a little bit more. I don't want us to have to worry. You know what I mean? So we got this. We're going to be sending our first crew out. Uh, I want to get our defenses up here. And then we're going to start sending our first little dispatch out. I don't know. You, I don't even know what we're really going to bring. We just need to roll more joints or something. <laughs> roll more joints. Bring more silver. Maybe we can, like, I don't know. Uh, I would really like it if in future updates of this game we can... Uh, nice. Sienna and Kyle are getting married. Beautiful. We have two married couples now. So they'll go in here and eventually clean and stuff. Uh, everyone's cleaning is pretty high priority, so let me just kind of two, something like that. So if you're not hauling, please clean. I would really like it if cleaning was a top priority for everyone. Good. Sienna's cleaning. Want to just make sure you're, you know base is clean for the wedding, you know what I mean? At least that. Let's check that cleanliness in here, it's getting better. Okay, yeah, definitely better. Very rich, very spacious, very impressive. Mm -hmm. It's fucking right. <clears throat> After this research, we're gonna have our refining, and then we will pick up, I believe, brewing. Whatever that is over here. We have an eclipse now, but that's fine. We have plenty of batteries. Solar generator broke down. We should have someone over there to replace that. Sooner or later, someone will come around to it. We got our fertile chicken eggs. Quite a few of them, actually. Uh, our overall trade beacon broke down. Sure, whatever. Like nothing is gonna stop this beautiful occasion for two beautiful people, Sienna and her fiance Kyle. How beautiful! How beautiful is this? I'm so glad that crazy cat and crooked cook decided to get all friendly, friendly. Maybe Gizmo and Hellboy, and yeah, and then Xander's just gonna be like the weird seventh wheel. <laughs> just fucking Xander, always in the way. Never actually doing anything. Bastard. Hey, this is gonna be like my production facility. Bolt good trader. Okay. Cool. Maybe we need like more steel. 
before that, we need to repair. Ooh. Hold on a fucking second. We need components. So I need to go over here and tell one of you guys to like go and mine this. Hellboy, you're not doing shit. Can't mine. Gizmo, can you mine? Not a sign to buy. You go mine. I know you're having your wedding soon, but I'm gonna need you to mine. Uh, biological 66 year old. You got a bunch of pirates on his tail? Sure. Pierce, welcome. Ah, everyone. Oh, this is your. Hellboy is your daughter. Kyle is your friend. Awesome. Beautiful. Beautiful. You're just a uh, phosphate. To impound body parts are unethical, nervous, mental break thresholds, a little high. Uh, we bad back though. Yeah, we don't really know what we can use you for, friend. Uh, so this is Gizmo. Gizmo, you're mostly going to be doing this stuff. Like, like this. Uh, yeah, smithing for... For, for... Plant cut if you got the time. Grow if you got the time. You can construct. Uh, you don't handle... You can warn, didn't I guess? Sure, sure. We'll just set these to one. Uh, you're a mediocre doctor, so we're actually gonna have you be a little bit lower priority. And just recruit, unrecruit everyone. Good. And this is the attack. EMPs, uh, steel longsword, pump shotgun, light machine gun, awful. This guy's got a charge rifle. This guy's got a doomsday rocket launcher. Hmm. Let's get an assault rifle. Alright, Pierce, we're gonna need you to just, yeah, wherever you wanna go, go now. So here, here, hmm, maybe Gizmo can go here, Xander, you can go here. Kyle, if you would like to go there, please. You go here, Crooked Cook. Go and man your little telescope. All right, everyone, get in position. Gizmo, are you ready? Pierce is gonna run right past ya, right past ya. Okay, Gizmo, whenever you're ready to throw, I'll tell you when. Right now. Good, now you run for your life. Come over here, man this. Pierce, yeah, you just go and do whatever you want, man. Alright, that basically did nothing. Ooh, nice. Gizmo's dead. Doomsday rocket launcher is pretty insane. Uh, he's not dead. That's about to kill me. Hmm. Maybe I should have thought that a little more. Okay, so you guys are all freaking out and doing crazy stuff. Crazy Cat. And Xander. Okay, so you guys can't go anywhere. Sienna and Gizmo are dead. Sienna, unfortunately, won't be able to see her, um, husband. But it looks like uh, we're all fine. To take one, we had to lose two, apparently. And he's not even that crazy good. So I don't know if it was actually that uh, that over the top or that necessary. I mean, we didn't even get the Doomsday rocket launcher. Right? Yeah, like here's this cyber assault rifle, light machine gun. Yeah, like, did we even get the Doomsday Rocket Launcher? No, I don't think so. I don't actually think we did. Hmm. Yeah, oh well, what are you gonna do, though? Yeah, well, okay, so you go and rescue Hellboy. Xander, go and rescue Crooked Cook. Yeah, this son of a bitch. Caillou, cult kid. You just dive bombed right into these bastards. Whatever, it's fine. No one 
really has a problem with anything right now. Yeah, just bring our people back to town. Everything's fine. This is gonna be a prisoner now. Crazy cat, if you could actually capture. Thank you. Uh, we need a zone. This. Yeah, Kyle's freaking out because his well, fiance died. He's probably really sad about that. Yeah, my fiance, my friend, middle finger. <laughs> All kinds of bad things, man. But technically, it's not even all that bad. Another one of those uh, do do hickeys blew up. Yeah, so we need some kind of I don't know defensive wall, I guess, around my base, huh? That sounds like something we could accomplish, uh, Kyle. Before you do that, strip. Now bury the body. Can you strip and then bury? Thanks. And looks like Hellboy and the Crooked Cook both ended up hit biting the fucking dust. So, I mean, this is extreme mode. I did want this guy. Apparently I asked for this. Bury this guy. Good. Good, good, good. Hopefully, well, now we're back down to four. Pierce, there's plenty of armor. If you want to, like, I don't know, force for this. Thanks. Yeah, well, one colonist idle. On a start fire spree, huh? You want to, like, not fucking do that, you stupid bastard. Alright, well, let's check out our power situation. So this is fine. These are connected. Down here, there's nothing anymore. Let's go one, two, three, four, five. One, two, three. And let's go like four, five. And let's do one, two, three, four, five. And then we're going to do something like this. Felt like this would have been a little bit better. And yep. And then one more here. Just a line of five cannons, five of these automatic turrets in front of us, and then the machine gun complex. And then we can have our other, like, main cluster of colonists in the center somewhere, defending themselves, like here, in here, or something, for example. <sighs> that was pretty, pretty lofty losses, if I do say so myself. I didn't want that to go down that way, but sometimes it's just how the cookie crumbles. All right, we gotta we gotta reprioritize some things here. So let's see, warden, that's fine. We have any doctors? We need you guys to like priority one doctor too. Uh, no hunting. Uh, warden's fine. Construction, yes, please. Uh, yeah, we're like two, two all the way down the board. Hunt cut two. You can do all that stuff like that and like that. Let's go ahead and just get everyone reset and hopefully we'll get around to fixing this shit. Crazy cat, there's no one to actually call. How's our standing with the other factions? 23, Tespi at the stream. So if we called Tespi at the stream, let's just say, what can we say? Offer gift. Chris, request trade caravan, cost 600. And just increase the standing with this tribe, I don't know, I think that's fine. <clears throat> so we can just call for a trade caravan, okay, let me just see. Everyone have some kind of weapon. Uh, Kyle, you can have, of course, all you have, come and take this. Can you call this? You're still a pretty decent shot, but I don't want you to keep that. You are pretty shit shot, but you are going to take this off. Oopsie, that's the one I want to make you take off. Pierce, force fire the power arm. Now Pierce, come out here and put this. There we go. 
getting things repaired. I guess that's fine. Just haul some of this shit out of here. Steal goddamn chunks. Oi, oi, oi. Need to be able to research how to, uh. Mmm. What's it called? Take slag, uh, slag steel, this stuff, right? Slag steel, steel slag chunks. And turn it into steel. That'd be real nice. Crazy cat, you wanna come and talk to this bulk good treader? You have steel, please. All of it. However much I can take. Like, if I can have 800, 700. Oops. Uh, I think I just canceled the recording. Don't worry about that, ladies and gentlemen. I'm sure it's nothing. Uh, how much do we need to do? Um, let's do like 660. How about 640? How about 635? How about 630? <laughs> 25. 620. How about 617? Perfect. 617 units of steel gets dropped down on us. Perfect. Uh, I'm actually going to prioritize that we make the steel gun complexes first. Because those are going to save our asses more than the actual complexes. Shield user has ranged weapon. Of course he still does for some reason. Personal shield. Let's go ahead and drop it. Okay, a couple people got extreme break wrist, pierce, of course, because my daughter Hellboy died. Moderate amount of pain before people died. Dead man's power armor. What's that? Uh, I'm wearing a pair that someone died in. It creeps me out and it feels dirty. Yeah, well, shut the hell up. It's a great power armor. Nothing wrong with it. Xander, if you would actually like, go ahead and forswear this power armor. Alright, it's like nothing ever really happened. <laughs> Three power arms are still technically in use. Plenty of military helmets are still getting things hauled around. Uh, we got 900 units of steel in the stockpile. Let's go ahead and see if we can, like, unforbid something potentially. Nope. Oh, a crazy cat's like, let's go and have a party, huh? A little bit of a social event, sure. Crazy cat is just like, I need to make sure that these fucking sandbags are good. Now Kyle and Crazy Cat are all like hunky door because both of them lost their lovers and they're like, you know what? It's about time that we start moving on, huh? Let's get it done. Now let's start banging together. So I guess we're gonna start using this bed. Where's Crazy Cat? Crazy Cat and Kyle. They're already they're already sleeping together. Great. Game out of hand, they put them together. Minor break risk, good pierce is just kind of kind of chilling. It's kind of high, that's fine. Stone on smoke leaf, exotic goods trader, that's fine. Good, good. We're just set, establishing our defenses again. Apparently, we're gonna do these down here first, which is fine. Stone cutter table needs to be rebuilt. We'll just do something like that. Yeah, it'll be a work penalty for being outside, but that's whatever. Okay, there goes the second one. We're moving some stuff out of the way. Good, perfect. Getting this shit out of the way, moving fertile chicken eggs around to stockpiles. These are just dead chickens that we need to cut up and make into meals. Okay, I mean, you know, one good thing about having a couple of people trimmed down is uh, having it a uh, less mouths to feed, <laughs> is what I'm trying to say. But yeah, so far, so good. I mean, this is going to be a wonderful RimWorld series, ladies and gentlemen. If you guys want to see more, don't forget to, uh, don't forget to keep watching. I, uh, I hope you guys... Really appreciate what I'm doing uh, here, and I hope you hope to see you come back day after day. Watch some of my channels, my videos, my daily banter. Farewell.